Television City in Hollywood. This is the $25,000 Pyramid. Today's special guests are Lois Nettleton and Bill Cullen. And now here is your host, Dick Park. <laughs> Thank you very, very much. Thank you, Johnny Gilbert. <clears throat> Hey, that's the kind of greeting that'll get your Monday off to a good start. How are you, Lois? Fine, Dick. How you doing? Are you enjoying your summer? Uh, yes, so far. Very good, yes. Uh-huh. We have a new player with us here uh, who's never played this game before on television, uh, Paul uh, Feig, who is a cartoonist. Have you oh. played this thing at home? Oh, all the time. You've practiced? Constantly, constantly, yeah. What sort of cartooning do you do? Uh, funny cartoons. Uh, I hope. And clean, <laughs> very clean. Are they one-panel things or yeah, one animation or what? Mm -hmm. Just one panel. I was a cartoonist at USC for a year and a half and uh, I'm freelancing now. But... I wish you much good luck in your future endeavors there and here in the winner's circle. Bill Thank Cullen's God. been over to that spot. What did you, what, of all the times you've been in there, what have you learned about going to the winner's circle, Bill? Uh, it's a long walk. <laughs> that, that was and, it. Huh? And one is prone between here and there to get hungry, frightened, nervous, but my contestants, my, my partners, always pull me through. Susan Levine. What a sweet guy. <laughs> yeah. You, you, you really pulled that through. You're yes. banking it. You're laying all the blame on the lady now. <laughs> Susan Levine, uh, how much money did you win uh, last time we were in here? 750 big ones. And you are a dental, is it, is it hygienist? Yes, uh-huh. Not hygienist. Hygienist. Right. Hygi mm -hmm. Say it again. Hygienist. 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 See, mm -hmm. I did it yeah. wrong two ways. Yeah. Bill Cullen would never do that. <laughs> Who knows? No. He wouldn't even use the word. He doesn't no. know what it means. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. I'm no fool. Over here in the winner's circle, good people. Uh, that is the winner's circle. You try for ten or $25,000, and we'll turn to that uh, more in length later on. These are the subjects up there for you, Lois. We have the trading post for starters, down under, what a, with a little help. This too shall pass. Ear today, gone tomorrow. The 7-Eleven is the bonus card. We'll talk about it when it turns up. Lois, what would you like? We're going to start with for starters. For starters. These are things that start other things. Paul, things that start mm -hmm. other things. Okay. Ready? Go. The first meal of the day? It's breakfast. Uh, when you're five years old, you go to school. It's to, kindergarten. Mm -hmm. um, it, it taps is played on a... A bugle. Mm -hmm. Um, to start your car, you turn the... The ignition? Mm -hmm. um, before you have your meal, you have a little... Oh, an uh, appetizer. Mm -hmm. uh, and uh, when and they, they're fencing, they go, oh, when oh, they're ready. Foil? Oh, uh, oh, um, say, uh, touche. Mm, they mm, no, say, on guard. Mm -hmm. Go on. Uh, uh, to the Constitution. The amendment. The, the, the Oh, part. the preamble. Mm -hmm. That's got it. Seven out of seven. Tell the truth now, Lois. When, when was the last time you were fencing? Well, what did I say? Nothing. I no. just watched what you did. Oh, I did it all wrong, right? Well, well I, just, I thought you had a, a lance in your hand. <laughs> right. Bill, which one would you like? I haven't fenced, but I was there when they wrote the preamble. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Fair enough. We're going to take a, with a little help, please. With a little help. And Describe any... these things that make things better. Make things, things that better. make things better. better. Ready. Go. Uh, this. A hug. Yeah. Uh, it's a nutmeg and mace and... Uh, uh, spices. Yes. Uh, you say this... When you're praying. Uh, a guy who, who twists you around. It's not a doctor, a but... A masseuse. He, no, he twists you. He twists you. a chiropractor. That's the guy. Uh, when you're in school, you go from the second grade to the third, you get a... You get a promotion. That's right. Uh, this you go for mental and physical... Therapy. That's right. Uh, you go and have this rub. Massage, it's face, a, facial. That's it. That's got it. Got <laughs> Game being played right now. I think we did well there. Thank you. You're good. Paul Feig, what's your pleasure here? Well, we're going to try Down Under. Down Under is Get the it. one with the 7 11 oh, behind it. for you. And to win $1,100, it brings up to 14 points. Describe for Lois these things that are fluffy. <coughs> things that are fluffy. Okay. Fluffy. Ready. Go. Okay, this is in the sky and it rain comes Clouds. out of it, right? And uh, this, when you have hair, you cut these across, Bangs. right? And uh, this is something you will fluff up and you Pillow. lay on, yes. And uh, this is you roast it over an open fire when you're Chestnut. camping. Uh, no. um, marshmallow. Yes. And uh, this is Lassie was a dog. Type, uh, uh, what type of dog? Oh, yeah, a, sh a shepherd. Uh, no, no, uh, uh, yeah, collie. You're right, exactly. And uh, lemon blank pie. Meringue. Okay. And uh, this you're cooking its eggs and Souffle. you flip it over. And uh, you cook it Marais. in a pan, and then you flip it over. Oh, and you have... Yes. All right. Austin and at the time. Eleven hundred dollars. Oh my gosh. 
rule of the game says that the tie, or if you start the answer, beats the buzzer, you said, uh, 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 uh omelet. You got it. 14 to 7. Susan, what would you like? That's great. I think we'll take the trading post. Okay, describe for Bill these words that begin with the letters T-R-A. These words all begin with the letters T-R-A. Ready, go. This is when you go on the flying... Trapeze. Right. This is when you leave a little nut something... Trail. Right. This is when you can see through something... Transparent. Right. This is when you're in a... Trance. Right. This is when, to start your car, you start the... Tr 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 transmission. Right. right. <laughs> and this is when you take a pill because you're so nervous, you take a... Uh, the tranquilizer. Right. <laughs> and this is something like Fiddler on the Roof was, the song was... Uh, tr 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 yes, come keep going. No, oh. not that much. What is it? Tradition. Tradition is... Uh... Oh. Having turkey on Thanksgiving or oh. uh, something else. You want to explain to her about transmissions, Bill, or shall I? In her family, it was tradition to start the car with a transmission. <laughs> all right, fair enough. It's 14 right. to 13. Oh. Uh, we have a point spread. That means you have the choice. Bill or Susan, which one would you like? Hmm. Ear today, gone tomorrow. Okay, who'll give and who'll receive? What do you want to do? You want me to give? You may. All right. Susan, describe these things associated with an ear. Things associated with an ear. Ready, go. This is my... Lobe. Right. You put these little things in if you have an ear infection. Uh, drops. Right. And this is what, on the phone, what you hear through. Earpiece. Uh, no, receiver. Your, yes. And this is what I'm doing. I'm... You're pulling your ear. You're... What am I doing? You're tweaking your no, lobe. No, a little dog's tail goes... Wagging your ear. No, more. I'm, like, what you have, if you don't have hair on your head, you wear a... A wig. You're so wiggling, you're, wiggling right, your right. hair. <laughs> and this is when you're off... Balance. Right. And this is what you put on your ear to keep them warm? Um, earmuffs. Right. And this is if you have an effect. So... Oh! <laughs> that one wouldn't fly. <laughs> 19 to 14, we'll see if they can pull up six answers here. They've got to come up with 20. Lois, you're going to give? Mm -hmm. You need 20 points. These are things that are temporary. Things Tem that are temporary. Okay. All right, they need 20. Ready? Go. <coughs> a cough. Um, you're having a secret love. An affair. Mm -hmm. uh, <coughs> a hiccup. Mm -hmm. um, in your tooth, you have a gold. Oh, a uh, filling. Mm -hmm. um, dandruff comes off in... Oh, in snow. Chung. Oh, uh, flakes. Snow. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, um, you have a, a little puppy love. You have a... Oh, hey, uh, a crush. Mm -hmm. That's the 20 points. We're headed for the winner's circle for $10,000 right after this. We're into the winner's circle for the first time. That means we'll be going for $10,000. I say we because we all feel like we're on your team, Paul. We want you to win it. Your team member over there is really only Lois, but the rest of the audience and I will be rooting for you with fingers crossed and all of that. Try to visualize in your mind what she's talking about. Say everything that comes to mind. The most frustrating thing here is for somebody to say, gee, I thought about it, but I didn't say it. Mm -hmm. Do it anyway. Even all if right. it comes out strangely, it doesn't matter. Good luck. All right. For $10,000, here is your first subject. Go. Uh, uh, solitaire, old maid, Games poker. are played by uh, card games. Um, well, I have chocolate ki chips in me and I'm baked. What a cookie would say. Mm -hmm. um, her steno pad. Things used by secretary. Mm -hmm. Stereo music. Song of the birds. Things that sound good, things that are lovely. Uh, uh, a seashell. Uh, things you listen to. Mm -hmm. Um... Uh, chicken pox. Um, unpaved roads. Things that are spotty. Things that have holes. Things that are... Uh, unpaved roads. Things uh, that are bumpy. Mm -hmm. Um, the police cars. The night guard. Uh, things at a bank. Things... Boy Scouts. Things that help other things. Things uh, that... An army... Oh, 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 no. A prowl car. A uh, car. police car. Border guard. Border guard. Things of patrol. Oh. You got it. Oh. In, in this case, not never. better late than never. Uh, <laughs> late here does not count. $750. Excellent score. We'll be back to play the second round in a moment. Great. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Paul Figures won $750. The good part of that, Paul, is it's a tough score to beat in case you don't get lucky in this round and it doesn't come together and Susan should head over there. She has her work cut out for her. It'll be the men against the women this time. Lois, what's this thing called? Outlaws. A movie, is it? Oh, yes, that's a, a Have TV. I caught you unaware that you're uh, yeah, right. <laughs> Anything I've said? Uh, <laughs> it's a uh, CBS movie called Outlaw, it says. Uh, Outlaw, uh-huh. It'll be on in the fall. We're, I'm about to go up to um, uh, Colorado to oh, film it. Oh, you haven't it. done it yet. No. Uh -uh. Well, no wonder you don't yeah. have a feel for it. Yeah, right. Is it a and vintage thing, a period piece? Uh, no, as a matter of fact, it's about a double killing. It's a true story, and it isn't finished yet. I mean, it's in real life, it's ongoing. People, when they see it, a lot of people will remember reading about it. Really? And uh, wonderful people in the, in the cast, Rip Torn, Claude Aikens, Pat Hingle, and we'll Matt Salinger. Oh, it'll be this wonderful. fall? Uh, this fall. Mm -hmm. we'll Script by John it. Gay, and just terrific. Okay. Remember the name? <laughs> Outlaw, when you see it in the Outlaw, listings. Right. Susan, you're up on deck. These are your subjects. We have Keep It Straight, There's a Time and a Place, Let's Pretend, Bond Voyage, uh, Weighing In, Twist and Turn, we're going to play ourselves a mystery seven, as we always do. And if you come up with seven out of seven correctly, you'll win a trip for two to Australia as a bonus present. <laughs> All right, they want to go with you, Susan. What would you like? Let's try weighing in. Weighing in is the choice. Lois, you are to describe these things that are weighed. weighed. Things that are weighed. Ready, go. Your luggage or your, your, your suitcase. Uh, the whole thing. The whole luggage. thing is your luggage, your bags. Mm. Mm -hmm. Baggage. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, the judge gives a... Uh, at the end of the trial. He gives a summons. Uh, the jury he gives, gives a, a decision. A, mm -hmm. uh, he, he gives a... Uh, uh, go, go on. Mm -hmm. um, to make the grass grow, you put, put fertilizer. Mm -hmm. um, a kind of steak. Not T-bone, but... But porterhouse. Mm -hmm. no. Or sirloin. Mm -hmm. um, you wrap up a Christmas... Uh, Package. Mm -hmm. um, just the blank, ma'am. Uh, oh, boy, folks, you're going to have to do a little catching up in the next round. Bill and Paul, you have a decided advantage, provided you don't fall flat on your faces here. Uh, the ladies picked up four, which is not the heftiest score they could have gotten. What would you like? We're going to try a let's pretend, please, Dick. All right, describe these Halloween costumes. Uh -oh. Halloween costumes. Hmm. Ready, go. Uh, guy in the circus. Oh, a clown. Mm -hmm. uh, she rides a broom. A witch. Uh, uh, a, uh, an old Roman, he travels from place to place in Hungary. Uh, they oh, have wagons and they tell fortunes. Oh, a gypsy. Uh, a, just the bones of a person. Oh, a skeleton. Uh, the, the monster who was made by... Franken or, uh, yeah, Frankenstein. It's basically. the guy. Hmm. Uh, a tramp, another word for tramp. Hobo. Mm -hmm. uh, the guy who went uh, and, and got, all those, got in with all those snakes, made a movie about him. Uh, oh, uh, oh, um... Uh, Indiana Jones. Jones. <laughs> 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 I think you got it. I, you started, I don't know. Oh, no. <laughs> I terrific, really, terrific description of the film, Bill. I really know movies, Dick. I'm <laughs> the guy who got in with all the snakes and they made a movie about it. Yeah. Yeah. And he got it. There you go. Yeah, well, a little late. All right, it's six to four. Ladies, it isn't as bad as it could be. Where would you like to go now, Susan? Keep it straight. Keep it straight it is, and that's the one that could win you the trip. points to that score, get up to 11, and she's off on a beautiful trip down under. Here's your 30 seconds now. Ready and go. What do you read on? You look to go someplace, you look to go on the... Right. And you're reading this? Tom. The, the reader reads? Yes. And you're writing on... What you write on? To write a letter. Paper. Right. And you go down the rocky... Road. Right. And this is the animal with the stripes? The tiger. No, the big one in, in Africa? It looks like a horse. Oh, a uh, zebra. Right. And this is a piece of paper. It's called, or something off a tree that falls is a... Uh, no, a thing that falls off a tree. The green thing that falls off a tree. Right. And this is a round thing with all the countries on it. Matt. No, what is it? Oh, oh. <laughs> Things that have lines. <laughs> Susan, relax a little bit, will you? My, I'm, so cool. I'm in a panic. My heart's pounding over here. No, no, it falls off the trees. <laughs> Is everybody uh, back in order? <laughs> Frantic time. Right? Where are we? Ten to six. Paul, it's your choice. Uh, there is a time and a place. Time and a place. All right. <laughs> Describe these places where people find romance. Oh. Places where people find romance. Ready. Go. Okay, this is, uh, you go there and you go swimming and, uh, beach. sand right. And this is somewhere where you work, uh, you have a secretary. In the and, office. Yeah. And, uh, this is in Italy. It's the most, one of the most romantic cities. It's got the, uh, Rome. Right. 
And uh, this is, you go to summer camp. Right. And uh, you go on a boat, take an ocean liner. Cruise, on the, yes. And uh, this is where cowboys find love. On, uh, the, uh, on the plains, on the, no, on uh, the rain. It's a type of salad dressing. Uh, Thousand Island. Well, you guys started out with a heck of a lead, and you're blowing it left and right here now. Oh, where, where do cowboys find love? On a thousand <laughs> islands. Where else? <laughs> On a ranch. A cruise, huh? Ranch. A ranch. The ranch. It's Eleven to ten. Ladies, right. there's, there's still light at the end of the tunnel here. Oh, you're up against said, these two buffoons over here. Oh, come on. She says, be, you know what she said? She said, be fast. I'll be cool. Oh, no, seriously. Seriously. Got to get you all back in order. You're a little panicky. Oh, They've lost track of what they're doing over there, so that works to your advantage. Now, ladies. <laughs> Which one do you want? We're going to take twist and turn. Twist and turn. All right, let's just methodically go through now. These are things that bend or have a bend. bend. Things that bend or have a bend. Ready, go. When you want to stop the ship, you, you throw put down. anchor. Mm -hmm. um, he does uh, tricks, trapeze. Oh, things. a trapeze artist. Uh, mm -hmm. uh, in, in the Olympics. He's mm -hmm. an athlete. Mm -hmm. Triathlon. Uh, uh, the, uh, oh, he does uh, gymnastics. Go yeah. It's, it's, uh, go. go ahead. Uh, on the end of a fish line is a the hook. Mm -hmm. um, in Australia, you throw this. A, a zuba mm -hmm. um, You play, it's a, it's a brass tuba. instrument. Tuba. Um, Trumpet. Um, uh, uh, Tuba, trumpet. <laughs> let's, go, let's go on. We'll go on to the next one. Uh, your soup, you did. Uh, oh, my God. Mm -hmm. Oh, ladies, ladies. <laughs> that was the best one. Oh, that's the acro acrobat slowed you down. Saxophone didn't help either. This is not looking good, folks. <laughs> Gentlemen, you need... We tried. You haven't reckoned with us yet, Dick. <laughs> D despite yourselves, you may win this. <laughs> it's, uh, you need 14 points. Who's going to give other, Paul? You or uh, Bill? Oh, uh, I'll receive. All right. Yeah. Uh, Bill, describe these things in a James Bond movie. Uh, James things Bond movie. James okay, Bond. Where James Bond finds love. Yes. 14 <laughs> points. Ready? Go. Uh, you jump out of an airplane, this keeps you from... Parachute. That's it. Uh, girl, it's not a brunette, it's a... Blonde. And finally, we have a dit dit daw, a Morse... A code. That's it. That's the 14 <laughs> points. We'll be back to play off the winner's circle right after this. Gentlemen, because of that stellar round you just played, we have <laughs> lost a lot of time here. We're going to go for $25,000. Concentrate now. Here's your first subject. Go. Uh, alarm grandfathers. Types of clocks? Because you've committed a crime. Why you go to jail? Because uh, you made a policeman angry. Why you get arrested? The books, the, the card catalog, the volume. Oh, things in a library. A race. A television program. Things you watch. A radio show. Things you listen to. Things you... A, a foot race. A... Um, things you... I'll come back to it. Okay. Next. Come back. Uh, a gear. Uh, hips. Things that grind. Sand, things that... Sands. Things that, uh, gears. turn. Things that... Gears. Things that move. Sands. Things that blow. No, no. Uh, things that... Transmissions. Oh, things... Sand. Oh, uh, go to the next one. Not enough time, really, Bill. Yep. No, that's... Oh, it's yeah. We're down to about two oh, seconds. No, I, I was... No, no. <laughs> I think that was my fault. No. What are some clues to that first yeah, one I missed? The first one? A uh, foot race. A fast race, any horse race, um, uh, a liftoff. Things, uh... Things yeah. with a countdown. Any horse. Uh, that's, that's good. A three-minute A. Oh, the things you time. That's oh, it. Three-minute oh, A. Different, I different so approach. Here, <laughs> the other one is things that shift, and we were struggling oh, with that. Yeah. By the time we get to the top, it's like two and a yeah, half seconds. Yeah, those yeah, were hard. No, those, uh, those you don't have any worries. You're going to be back to play again tomorrow, but we had another $300 yeah. to your prior take, which I think was $750. Right? Mm -hmm. We'll be back to summarize it all in a moment. Lois and Bill, before we say goodbye, let me take a second. Last Thursday, if you watched the daytime Emmys, you know something really nice happened to the pyramid. For the seventh time, the $25,000 pyramid won an Emmy. And I got one, too. We won twice. Thank you so very much. We appreciate it. To the Television Academy, to you for watching. We'll see you tomorrow for now. Dick Clark. So long.